Hey guys, it is Cheesy here, and today I am bringing you another Fallout 4 video. I know I haven't made a Fallout video in a long time, but that's basically because I haven't been playing video games much at all recently, let alone Fallout, because it has. We're approaching a year that Fallout has been out, and so I've pretty much seen all I wanted to, but there are still a lot of videos that I want to make, like this one, where I'm going to be visiting the Pridwin right out of the vault. Make sure to check out my other unique Fallout 4 content, and if we could smash 50 likes on this video, that would be insane. So getting straight into it, I opened up the console and typed in COC Pridwin Hall 01, and this is the command to teleport me into the Pridwin. I was surprised to see that it was already full with Brotherhood people, because as you guys know, and spoiler warning, the Brotherhood of Steel only appears after you kill Kellogg, and so... I was surprised to see that, you know, already out of the vault, just teleporting there, they had already shown up. One weird thing I noticed, and I'm not sure if you guys caught it, was that when I opened up my map inside the Pridwin, it still showed me right next to Vault 111. Now I'm making this video to show you guys if you can continue on with the Brotherhood of Steel quest line right out of the vault, and so I tried to talk to the Brotherhood of Steel characters. As I made my way through the ship, however, no one would start their dialogue with me, and as you can see here, Elder Maxon wasn't even there. And this was the same case with Lancer Captain Kells. He just simply didn't show up. I noticed that when I was looking for Kells, I was overlooking the Commonwealth, and I typed in TCL into the console command area, and I was able to step out of the Pridwin, and as you can see, we actually are above Boston Airport. Getting back to trying to progress with the story, I went back to where Elder Maxon usually is, and I used the place at me command to place or spawn in an Elder Maxon right beside me. I kept trying and ended up using set stage commands to try and further progress through the Brotherhood of Steel questline. And I actually reached the point where you first meet Elder Maxon, however, as you can see here, he's not actually there, and all the people do is just tell you to face him. So, once again, I spawned in an Elder Maxon. But, yet again, I was unable to talk to him, and I couldn't progress with the quest line. I kept trying with the set stage commands, and started the Shadow of Steel quest, which is the first Brotherhood of Steel quest that involves the Pridwin. And the objective asked me to talk to Lancer Captain Kells, so I made my way down to where he's usually located, and of course, he wasn't there. This didn't stop me, however, as I used console commands to spawn him in. As soon as I spawned him in, he started talking to me, saying that I was the one Paladin Dance had under his wing. And so I finally thought that I would get somewhere with the quest line, however, he just kept repeating this line, and I could still not progress with the story. When I made my way back up, I saw that the people were standing, and it looked like Elder Maxon might start speaking to them. However, nothing happened. So unfortunately, that is it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. I like to bring you guys videos like these, however, because some obviously not all people have a PC and can't do this. So I like to show those people what happens when you do these things, and while sometimes nothing necessarily happens, I'd still like to show myself doing it. And so thank you guys for watching. Make sure to check out my other Fallout 4 videos that I will have annotated and linked. And also make sure to subscribe for more unique Fallout content and unique content from other games coming soon like Overwatch, Rocket League, and CSGO. So for now, I will see you guys later. Once again, thank you for watching and bye.